Can you actually believe it? We're working in the lab today. What? <laughs> I gotta look at it. When was the last time we worked in here? Oh gosh, I gotta go way back. Hold on. The last time we worked in here was when we discovered the ancient part of, well it's not ancient, forgotten part. This was the last room we worked on, which, oh, I love it so much. We're gonna be stealing some designs from this today, but uh, this is the official last thing we did, and this was six months ago. Six. What have we been doing for six months? This place is cool. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, I tell you what, it's just a lighting error, but this really puts me off from this place. But we are going to ignore it today because we will not be seeing it much because we are going to be working on the skeleton farm. I want to make a proper XP farm in my lab and skeleton based. So as you know, it was down this way, but I have it turning now. It's going to go down here and then turn this way and I've already got the chamber made which I think looks pretty cool made it out of quartz and we got an off and on switch in case we want to activate it if we want and I'm building in some other things too I think I want to put in a way to activate water and take away water I think these dispensers are going to throw health potions if we really need to get rid of skeletons that are in there but yeah our job today is to make this place look really cool as you can see we got some Redstone over here, we got kind of close, but I think we have enough room to make this place look pretty cool. So I'm gonna dig this out and start designing. Okay, I think this will work. So I'm not gonna do a mob elevator this time because those suck and I hate messing with them. Also, I forgot tinted glass was in the game. This is so nice. <laughs> so rather, I'm making a simple system where the water flushes them to just a small point like this, and I'm going to build a crusher into it. You know, just the timed crusher that brings him down to one hit, so I'll go ahead and wire that in now. As well, I'm running out of space down here because I just built another redstone contraption I'll show you in a bit, but I had this other idea. This is gonna be a really complex skeleton farm. <laughs> hey, you're not allowed to spawn up there. Uh, I might have to change that. I'll also put some delay on the repeaters to make it look cool when the lights turn on and off. It's like a slow on and off sequence. I hope this isn't just a bedrock bug. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm trying to test my crusher here. When it detracted the piston, they all just shot out the back and then I had to fight them all off. Luckily, they were all one hit. But I think it's because I had blocks missing right here. Hopefully that's the case. Are you kidding me? The quality life in this game is so bad that it can't even do that right. We can't use a crusher because bedrock edition sucks. How surprising. What's in here? Oh, this is my old freezer. Health research. I haven't been in here in a bit. I actually need something. What are these? These are water bottles. What about these? Water bottles. Have a, what? Come on. I need some scientists in here so we can brew some stuff. Okay, luckily we have the ingredients. No gunpowder? Are you kidding me? I need gunpowder. Oh my god. And I have no blaze powder over here. Okay, this place is just not ready to be used. <laughs> I just need a health potion. That's all I freaking need. Healing. Oh, wow, look. Sweet. So I just settled with a lava killing system. Uh, I'm going to test that out now. I think I have it just right so I can throw one potion at him. I bet it's not going to be enough. That didn't even seem like enough. Ah, I knew it. The armored skeletons. It's going to have to do for now. Maybe we can change it in the future. I've been held up on this for so long just trying to figure out a killing system because I don't want to do drop damage like an elevator going up, like I said. That'll do for now. Let's start designing this place. Uh, this problem with the pistons is really destroying my whole idea for this. So I also want to implement adding in powdered snow like this because we can turn them all into strays. Is that what they're called? Strays? Because then you can get slowness arrows, but of course... Once they turn into them, you flip this off and pull it back, they all pop out this side. Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. Go freaking figure. Oh my god, this is ruining everything. Alright, I don't know what I showed you last, but I <laughs> it's probably like three hours later just trying to figure out all the redstone. 
As you can see, I'm going for the same vibe as the last place we built in our lab. I just, I like this look so much, so it's probably gonna be the future of our lab. Uh, put some more canisters here to make it look like maybe this is what's injected in here. You can see I'm still designing this, but I have a little sliver down here and this is finished somewhat. So we got the kill chamber right there. Here I'm gonna put storage for like health potions. And then here we got the control panel, which is what I've been wiring forever. So we got a weakened mobs, hang on. We also got lights here. Let's turn on the lights, obviously. I'm gonna go ahead and weaken them. We also have a water block, which does this, just in case I need to get in there. Just gets rid of the water. I don't know, I like fancy stuff. And then I went ahead and added the stray transformation. It's just one powdered snow block up there. Maybe one day they will fix it. But yes, now they are all, actually I think, well, I haven't really tested it yet, but uh, yeah, I think they're all mainly one hit right now with a sword. But I've never really tested it with these yet. Ugh. Yeah, didn't get all of them, but... So I'm probably going to make a looting three sword to put in here that I can use to smack them. Because lava's tricky. I don't know any... Uh, wait, why is this all... Oh, it's not filtered yet. <laughs> I can't think of a way to wire it to make the lava hold there longer, or... I don't know exactly how that would work. But down here, we got a big storage system. This took, as you can see, a lot of hoppers. And I think I need to make it bigger because just after like three of those that I just did right there, it's already filled one chest. And it's these stupid bows. I think it's looting. Looting three is the problem. All I want from this is bones. That's really all I want. So yeah, we have all these controls here and I think <laughs> I'm gonna try to add another one with the room I have left, which is not much. Um, so right here where this granite block I placed is, I think I am going to put Sticky piston and a block here so when I activate it, it'll be pushed over and it'll prevent more skeletons from falling so we can have a stopper if we want to. There's something very nostalgic about here in Minecraft rain. At least for me there is, and I mean indoor Minecraft rain, not outside. It just sounds so cozy. There we go. I think we're all set up. Did it reach? Of course not. Skeleton drop block. Sounds good. All right, so that will obviously activate that right there. So now they won't be able to fall in case I just want to stop it. Then of course the powdered snow is right there. All right, I'm done with redstone. I guess one thing is, is if I really just need bones and not XP, I can just hit this button again and kill them all and not get so many bows. You always gotta wonder where these random portals lead. I'm a curious cat. I'm gonna find out. Ooh, quartz. That's all I've been doing, as you can see by my inventory here. I'm almost almost broken. I'm glad I caught that. But my god, I forgot how much quartz this lab takes to make. Ooh, more quartz. Ooh, more quartz. Ooh, more quartz. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, more quartz. <laughs> okay. Looks suspicious, I must say. Whoa! Oh my god! This is the last place I was expecting to go! Good night. Oh, I love it when I come across random builds like this. What's this? Death, most likely. Wow. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, oh, I loved this base. Jesus. Leave any goodies? Nope. I mean, there's still potential out here. We can continue these weird homes we were making. I need to bring this map wall back home and put it in our... I need a map room in my lab of every base we've made. Huh. <laughs> Look at that. You can see the gray circle from where it's updated. <laughs> Looking better. Almost finished. I got all the walls up. Uh, I have these indentions right here. I think I want to put pipes there. Just because, you know, why not? I don't think I'm going to do anything else in here. It's pretty much done. I'm just going to come here to get XP, as usual. And bones. Yeah, other than that, I think we're going to be done. Okay, and there we go. Just added in some pipes that look very technical. Uh, this one's the hydraulic for the block stopper. This is a gas line. 
you know, just to power some stuff. This is a gas line for these right here. Yeah, <laughs> um, I added in some. You know what I love is that I can use as many sea lanterns as I want now because we have that guardian farm. So as you can see, it surrounded the whole place. It's done, it's finished. Just gotta plug up these holes. Got some more pipes right there. Boom, boom, there we go. All right. Oh, I gotta add some shelving here. Looks fine and dandy to me. I'm probably gonna have to put some brewing stands there so we can make health potions if I decide to kill him that way. I'm finished with this place. I am moving on. But also, I'm not gonna do this now, but I'm gonna have to make this look pretty on the outside too, just like that. I'll probably just square it off and put some fake windows in as well. Well, I have 52 levels. I'm going to use this to try and get something decent on these. If you're not caught up, I'm trying to make the best armor you can possibly make. I actually have it all written down here. I think this is the best armor you can get all together. So I'm going to keep enchanting these until I get the most of all these enchants on one item. Obviously, if I get like fire protection or blast protection, I'll just throw it in a grinder. I need lapis. Gosh dang it. Lapis. There's no lapis in there. La that's not lap. Supposed to have lapis here, right? Nope. Huh. Don't you just love being organized? We. Oh wow, look at that. Alright. It's kind of sad seeing this place. I put so much work into it and then we had to revert back to the old save. But for all I know, this is what caused that corruption. Okay. What are options? Heck no. What about you? Heck no. Everything I don't want. Why is it always everything I don't want? Every single one of them is everything I don't want. I don't want projectile, I don't want fire protection, and I don't want blast protection. Well, I'll just reset it like that. Hopefully that resets it, right? Projectile protection. Ooh, protection three, but not four. Protection three, God. Protection three, protection three, protection three. Yes. Dang it, projectile. Protection three, protect, God. Yes. Gosh dang it. I'll take it, of course. I will continue to say this until the end of time. That's good, that's exactly what I want. But I will continue to say this till the end of time. Bedrock condition enchanting just feels worse than Java enchanting. Okay, actually we got a really good helmet, I think. And yes, I know thorns destroys your durability, but I want it on there. Because we're gonna have mending and unbreaking. So we need respiration, aqua affinity, and mending. Should we make the whole book first before we throw it on? Oh boy. Well, uh, this library is not that organized, so. Oh, armor is upstairs. Guess we just gotta get lucky and find it. Thorns. Feather falling. Respiration. Ooh, that's all I have? I don't want smite on there. It might mess with the levels. Wait, I gotta consult the book I made. Is there a Thorns 3? There is. But I don't think you can obtain it through an enchantment process. You actually have to craft Thorns 3. Oh my god. I don't even have any Thorns. Oh. And I lost all my mending books. Don't know where I put them. Luckily I have one in here. Okay, so do I combine the books first? I don't know how... I think this is gonna be too expensive or something. I did it. I did it. There's our armor minus Thorns 3. But I don't need Thorn 3. Okay, I found a Thorns 2 book in my fishing hut, but I'm not going to make Thorns 3 armor. I'm only going to do Thorns 2. Because it might make it too expensive, and yeah, we just don't need it. Um, so this will be... What? Why can't I view my enchants? What's happening? Oh, oh dang, I need more levels. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. Here we go. Oh, crap, I gotta name it. Ugh. Dang it. <laughs> this just never ends. The ancient wolf helmet. This is going to be, I guess, just the ancient wolf armor. There it is. And yes, I am slightly inspired by the Witcher because I'm the biggest Witcher fanboy. If you know, there are different schools in the Witcher universe, mainly Witcher schools. So there's the school of the wolf, the cat, the bear, the griffin, the viper. And most of them have to do with in-game creatures. So I might do that in Minecraft. There are wolves in Minecraft, so this is going to be school of the wolf armor. Ancient armor at right that. Okay, helmet is done. I will work on the rest in other episodes. From Banger Dude. Dose. You mentioned cheddar cheese combos in this video, but are they your favorite snack? And if not, what is? Oof. No, they're not my favorite snack. I just happened to see them at the gas station. I'm like, you know what? 
I want that. I haven't had them in a while, so that's what I got. But my favorite snacks, if I had to break it down, just like right now, which I am, which I have to do. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying that. I would say, well, pickles. You know those Oh Snap pickles? The Oh Snap Pickling Company, that's what they're called. Um, they have like those little packets of just cut up, pre-cut pickles. Oh my gosh. Those are up there. I am a huge pickle person, so um, pickles are one of them. Trust me, my girlfriend hears about it a lot. Uh, and I'm a big bean guy. Like, I I buy kidney beans. I should, probably should be using this, not wasting my lichen. But I buy kidney beans and just throw it in the microwave and eat it just like that. I have a problem. I'm sick in the head. At least I think I am. I don't know. Probably not. But I just like them. I'm a big bean guy. I don't know what to say. Also, peppered beef jerky. Oh, that's another one. Big favorite. Those are like my top three snacks if I had to like, and I enjoy chocolate here and there. Favorite cho- oh gosh. Almond Hershey's, that's my favorite chocolate bar. Um, <laughs> that's gonna be it for today, guys, though. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Wow, I already spruced this place up pretty well. I thought I was gonna come down here and have to do a lot of stuff. I just thought about it randomly. I'm like, you know what? I'll work on that. I'll see you in the next episode, though. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.